So we're down here in Hancock, and I think this is a pretty cool story. I heard this all when I was a kid growing up and through high school and stuff like that, and I think it's a pretty cool story, and I want to share it with you. In 1944, when two Hancock residents separately spotted something highly unusual as they each drove home after spending the evening with friends, they spotted two men underdressed and carrying large suitcases trudging through the snow along the side of the road. What they saw were two Nazi spies who made landfall in the U.S. after a two-month journey across the Atlantic Ocean in a German U-boat. In the suitcases, they had $60,000 in cash, 99 small diamonds, radio equipment, security ink, and a few other things. They said possibly the first enemy dressed in a military uniform to set foot on the continental U.S. soil since the Mexican War in 1840 and likely the last since. The spies walked through the snow in Hancock. The pair took a cab to Bangor, then a train to Portland, and then went to New York. One spy actually turned himself in, and the other was caught shortly.